Hello, Bobcats. Welcome back to another episode of The Sage. I'm Samuel Daher, your co-broadcast editor-in-chief. And I'm Elijah Sumlin. We have a packed show for you today, featuring a Legally Blonde recap, a Levi on the Street, a promo for the spring concert, and a sports segment. Let's get into it. Did you watch the Legally Blonde show? No, I didn't. How was the show? Well, let's take a look at this recap by Isabella Bernabio and Jack Donnelly. Last Thursday was the opening night of the Legally Blonde production by our Sage Creek Drama Department. The production is based off of the Legally Blonde musical, which premiered in 2007, and was based off of the movie Legally Blonde, which came out in 2001. The production starred Athena Wisner as Elle Woods, Elijah Johnson as Warner Huntington, Sarah Hackworth as Emmett Forrest, Bodie Hendricks as Paulette, and Ashlyn Plummer as Vivian Kensington. The play premiered to a theater packed with students of Sage Creek and family of the cast. There's one more drama production due for this year, so stay tuned for more. This has been Isabel Bernabio and Jack Donnelly for The Sage. What a great show with many talented actors. Great job, Blondes. Speaking of Blondes, do you have offer this trimester? No, but I'll have one next trimester. Here we have a Levi on the street about students taking off rule. What's up, Bobcats? I'm interviewing students about upcoming finals. On a scale of 1 to 10, how are you feeling about the upcoming finals? Um, probably like a 7, you know. A little nervous, but uh, we'll pull through. I think you'll do great. Thank you. Solid uh, four and a 4.5. Oh, that's pretty low. So why is it not above a 5? Um, finals are hard. Probably a 6. And... Um, why, why a six? I don't know. I just feel pretty confident about it. A solid uh, five. Why a five? I'm just dumb. <laughs> okay. So what are some tactics you're using to study for the upcoming finals? Um, I'm probably going to look at Google Classroom and look up YouTube videos. I love flashcards. Just flashcards or anything else? Um... And yeah, Con Quizlet's pretty good too. Yeah, Quizlet and Khan Academy. Just gotta believe, my boy. Uh, that's very true. Thank you. Yeah, I normally just, you know, take it easy the day before. You know, I want to make sure my mind is right for the day of the final. And I kind of just try not to strain my brain too much. Maybe find your favorite place to go study quietly. That's my advice for finding some good old-fashioned study time for yourselves. Good luck. Best wishes. We believe in you. Go Bobcats. Thank you so much. <laughs> Great interviews, Levi. Next, we have a promo for the Spring Concert by Olivia and Helen. The Spring Concert is one of the most exciting events happening for music students at Stage Creek. This year, the theme is Blooming Brilliant. And it's featuring all students from our performing ensembles. So we've got our orchestra, our chamber orchestra, our wind ensemble, we've got our jazz ensemble, jazz combo, and we've also got, um, for this concert and for the next one, we've got what are called chamber groups. We've been rehearsing pretty much in class, and some of us in chamber groups have performed like or practiced outside of class. Sometimes we would go um, outside of school hours, such as in the mornings or after school, to practice. And I'm look really looking forward to those chamber groups that build up um, these songs and pieces. We're doing some really beautiful overviewed music. Um, we're also having some really fun chamber groups playing. I, I believe we're having cello choir. So that's a group of about five, six cellos, I believe. I'm not in that, but it's going to be really cool. I've seen them rehearsing. Um, I'm really excited to get back into it. I think our winter concert was really successful, and there's a lot of potential that we have uh, for the spring concert. Lots of small groups, lots of musicians expressing the creativity. So um, in, in our jazz combo uh, before, that we're going to play, I think, either in the middle or before the concert, the, before the main portion of the concert, uh, we're playing a tune called Softly, as in a morning sunrise, and Hey Lock. It's going to be an exciting concert, lots of students expressing their musical creativity, and uh, you'd miss out if you don't go, so might as well come. Come see Sage's Spring Concert this Friday, March 3rd at 7 p.m. This has been Olivia Lee and Helen Howe for the Sage. Now back to the anchors. Wow, that looks great. Come support our Bobcats who are working hard. 
Lastly, we have a sports segment by Nick and Sebastian. Hey Bobcats, this week in sports we have boys baseball against La Jolla High on Thursday. Boys volleyball has their first game against Classical Academy on March 15th. Our girls softball team took an unfortunate 5-0 loss to Carlsbad, but we look to bounce back against Calexico today. Track and field held their mock meet on Tuesday and look to face their first opponent on Saturday. Tennis has a match against Mission Hills today at 3.30. Finally, boys lacrosse starts off their season against Chaparral. Hope you enjoyed the show, Bobcats. Make sure to check all of our latest articles and shows at thesagenews.com. Also, follow our Twitter and Instagram at The Sage Publication. Thanks for watching. This has been Elijah Sumlin and Samuel Daher reporting for The, the Sage. Sage.